Oh, I guess I should probably go s see, what's her name? Kawakami? Yeah, I better go see her. Hey there guys, Luigi Vance here. Welcome back to an episode of Persona 5 Royal. Boy, last time I went to school, but it wasn't the school. It was a castle. Kamashita was there and something about a talking cat. Sup? <laughs> so you're that problem transfer student. Late on the first day too. You like causing trouble for the school? I mean, this is just a misunderstanding. Huh, <laughs> excuses are useless. Do you even want to be reformed? I bet this is a good sign of what you'll be like here. The fuck does that mean? You know what, fine, whatever. I'm, I'll go into the second floor. Where's the fac faculty office? It's gotta be nearby. Hey, what's up? I can't recommend you for that college anymore. We suddenly decided a different student. What? But, but you already promised to recommend me. I'm sorry, but you'll have to accept that this was decided by the school. They want to prioritize students from our highly acclaimed volleyball team. Oh, ain't that jacked up. This is the principal's office. I don't want to go in there. Uh, Map will tell me. Map doesn't tell me. This is student guidance room. Oh, here we go. Faculty office. <laughs> Better go inside. What's up? Ugh. <sighs> Being over half a day late on your first day, can you explain yourself? Listen, I got lost. I was in a castle. I was gonna say, okay, I got lost. How could you have been lost for this long? It's almost lunchtime. Lady, I am a country boy who just moved to the city. I'm still trying to figure out how to get home. Well, it's probably true that you're not used to the area yet, but you're still way too late. Will you pull yourself together? You were given fair warning yesterday. More importantly, I heard that you were caught along with that Sakamoto kun. <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean by that, Sakamoto? <sighs> Don't get involved with him, okay? He's nothing but trouble. He wasn't like that when he was devoting his time to track and field, though. Anyway, break's almost over. Classes will end after fifth period today because of the subway accident. I'll have you introduce yourself when class resumes. Follow me. By the way, when you introduce yourself, be serious about it even if you're lying to the class, okay? Do not say anything unnecessary. Okay, I will completely say stuff that are necessary. You think that's him? Huh? The one in the rumors? Being super late on his first day? He really is insane. He looks normal, though. But he might slug us if we look him in the eye. Settle down. Well, I'd like to introduce a transfer student. Today we had him attend from the afternoon on since he wasn't feeling well. All right, please say something to the class. Hi, I'm Kazuma. He seems quiet, but I bet when he loses it... I mean, he was arrested for assault, right? Uh, so... Your seat will be... Hmm. Over there, the one that's open. Sorry, but can the people nearby please share your textbooks with him for today? Ugh, this sucks. <sighs> Lies. Huh? <sighs> Rude. Did you catch that? Mm -hmm. Do those two know each other? Ooh, does that mean he hit on her before transferring here? That means she's cheating on him with Mr. Kamashita. Then again, this is Takamaki-san we're talking about. For real, that side of the room is totally awful. Oh, right. The volleyball rallies in two days. Everyone's just changed classes, so make sure you use that time to get to know each other. Well then, let's get class started. Who's on duty today? Everyone, please rise.
Man, that was a nasty trip. Hmm? What's wrong? <laughs> yeah, is this a castle? Are you sure you're okay? Listen, it's like you said, I wasn't feeling well. Also, it seems like people are already talking about you, but I'm not the one who told them. Who squealed? I can't even catch a break. Why do I have to deal with this? Please, you have to deal with me. I have to deal with these rumors. You should head straight home without stopping by anywhere. Sakura's son sounded pretty angry. Ah, jeez, I forgot about him. Oh, and about Sakamoto-kun, don't get involved. Speak of the devil. What do you want? I heard the police caught you cutting classes today. <sighs> It was nothing. And you haven't dyed your hair back to black, either. Sorry about that. I'll be waiting on the rooftop. <sighs> See? That's why I don't want you getting involved. Understood? Why did you allow a student like him to transfer here? He's already started associating with Sakamoto. A student with a criminal record and the culprit of an assault case? At this rate, it'd be pointless how much I contribute to the school. Now, don't be like that. This school counts on you, kamashito -kun. You are our star. Still, a steady buildup is necessary behind such brilliance as well. Your troubles never seem to end, do they, Principal Kobayakawa? All right, I understand. I'll continue to do my best to answer your expectations of me. Well, better meet Sakamoto at the rooftop. Hey, buddy, you look down. Huh? Huh? I is there something you want from me? Where's the rooftop? Rooftop? Just... But nobody's allowed up there. I I mean, uh, just. Go up the stairs and you'll get there. I see my reputation starting to get <laughs> starting to get well known. Uh, rooftop, rooftop, yeah. Well, that's an off-limits sign, but it's unlocked. <laughs> Who didn't lock the door? There you are. What's up? Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like don't get involved with him, huh? <laughs> yeah, she said you're trouble. <laughs> We're pretty much in the same boat. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. <laughs> Buddy, it's not even a real, a real crime. It was all that that happened. You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Yup. Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. I mean, even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. But man, that Kamoshida we saw there. You probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. Is there? Is there a... Is there anything that's not a rumor? You mean that guy we met earlier, right? Yeah, the ripped mop head. Yeah, that's how I would use to describe him. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. No one says anything against him because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamashita was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. You know, we might be pretty similar. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. I don't know how I feel about that, but sure. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, alright? Be kind of hard to. See ya. Welp. 
guess I should go home. I got nothing else better to do. Ah, LeBlanc. Home sweet home. I'm tired. Hey, I got a call from the school. I hear you ditched half a day on your first day of school. I'm sorry. Just when I was thinking you had it together this morning. Look, it's like I told the teacher. I'm just a country boy living the city life. I still don't understand how a train station works. Look, just behave yourself. One wrong step and your life is over. You do know what probation means, right? <laughs> Unfortunately, I do. Good. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I just closed up shop. I'll head over in half an hour, as promised. What are you standing around for? Get upstairs and go to bed already. No, it's a guy. I just hired a part-timer. Yeah, telling a part-timer to go to sleep. Don't forget to lock the door and turn all the lights off, okay? Yep, I'm leaving now. I told you, he's a part-timer. He's telling me to go to sleep! That'll get their attention. Alright, well, is there anything I need to do? Not organized. Can I can I do anything with this? No. Can I do anything about this? No. Alright. Change and go to bed. Got it. Oh man, what a flippin' day. I'm going to sleep. About time you've come to. On your feet, inmate. Stop yelling Our master at me. wishes to speak with you. It's for your own sake that you take his words to heart. First off, let us celebrate our reunion. <laughs> oh yeah, celebrate. I'm surprised to see you again. A and the twin Hellions. Oh, you've awakened to your powers. And special ones at that. Your rehabilitation can finally begin. What do you mean, rehabilitation? There is no need to understand it all for the time being. No, I feel like there's time for understanding and I want to know what the answer is. You will be training the power of Persona, which you have awakened to. Personas are, in other words, a mask, an armor of the heart when confronting worldly matters. I have high expectations for you. <laughs> what do you mean? There is no need to worry. You will learn when the time comes. Stop saying that! By the by, have you come to appreciate the Metaverse Navigator? The what now? Using it will allow you to come and go between reality and palaces. Okay, I have questions. Like, what the hell's a palace and what the hell's a metaverse navigator? I bestowed it to you as a means to train you as a thief. Are you talking about that weird ass app on my phone? The metaverse navigator is a gift from our master. You better take care in using it, inmate. But I deleted it like three times. Clearly, I don't want it. Devote yourself to your training so that you may become a fine thief. Who said I want to be a thief? It must be disheartening to make use of the Metaverse Navigator alone. Should there be others who would prove beneficial to you, I will grant it to them as well. Well, I guess that's useful. This is all for you to grow as a most excellent thief. <laughs> it's time. Go back and enjoy whatever rest you might have. Oh, I gotta stop having weird dreams. What is this about fate and awakening? It's not Fire Emblem. Well, I better get ready for school, otherwise I'm gonna get yelled at again. Flip open the sign. And I got my umbrella this time. Haha. -ha. Seriously? 
What was that conductor thinking? Charging into the station at top speed like that. Oh, didn't you hear? That guy totally lost it. It's been happening a lot lately. <laughs> all of these light a all of these accidents are because people are suddenly losing their minds, right? Uh, what's going on? <laughs> well, between the economy sucking and how desperate the news always is, it's not all that surprising. Yeah, I would lose my mind too after all dealing with all that depressing attitude, I guess. <laughs> not crazy enough to like run over Look, the subway. Is that her? You mean that one with the red ribbon? Uh, I guess so. She's so thin. It's not fair. I've got my hair in a ponytail too. Okay, and what's that got to do with being thin? Please, take my seat. My station's coming up. Are you sure? Oh, then. Oh, wow, what speed. I mean, excuse me, that seat was for this lady. Oh. Want me to wake him up? I got it's you. It's alright. I can understand his position as well. I'm sorry I couldn't be any help. It's all right, dearie. Don't you worry. Please allow me to carry your luggage at least. Thank you. Ain't it heavy, though? Not at all. I train plenty. Pardon me. Thank you so much for earlier. Oh, uh, with what? For speaking up when I offered my seat on the train. I mean, for real though, I will wake that guy up. You're a second year at Shujin Academy, correct? I'm a first year there myself. Thinking you totally slipped my mind back on the train, and I didn't want to be rude to my senpai. Please excuse me. <laughs> what a morning. Well, better get better run to school. Here I am. I made it to school and no strange castle. Perfectly normal day. Just how I want it. Class is starting. <laughs> I'm the social studies teacher, Mr. U Ushimaru. I'll be teaching you the rules of society this year. <laughs> you all look like you've been spoiled growing up. Can't wait to see who disappoints me the most this year. A certain dictionary defines a year as a period of 365 disappointments. The book's title is actually about uh, is about as cynically satirical as the rest of it. It's the Devil's De the Devil's the Devil's Dictionary by Ambrose. B uh, I can't um, butcher names. Ambrose Beer Beers Beers. Hey, new kid. What? What's the answer? Tell me what the de what the Devil Dictionary uh, defined as chief factor in the progress of the human race. Ah, uh, it is intelligence. Do you know anything? <laughs> I didn't expect you to know. The correct answer is uh, male factors or villains. Remember that. Sure, villains can affect the course of history, but remember that this definition is sar uh, sardonic with <laughs> sardonic witism. Nothing more. I still pronounce that wrong. Here in the real world, villains don't push humanity forward. All they do is spread chaos and strife. I guess he doesn't study at all. We should stay away from him. Crap, the teacher's looking at us. Hmm, I kind of want to do a do-over. I have notes here, and it's just like, I guess I didn't update my notes. Because what I was supposed to show was what happens. And this is what happens. Okay, let's try this again. I know the answer now is villains. <laughs> Correct! Correct. Malfactors to be specific? You actually knew that, huh? Sure, villains can affect the course of history, but remember that was this definition of it, that this but remember that this definition is sardonic wit witticism. Wit witticism. Nothing more. Here in the real world, villains don't push humanity forward. All they do is spread chaos and strife. Wow, he got it right. Is he actually a criminal? He seemed like a punk, but maybe he's actually serious about studying. 
That's why you don't believe in rumors, and that is why I actually went through the effort to, like, go back in time. I'll explain what this is when we get the chance. Trust me, it, it will be important, and this is why I have notes. I know you all, you've all heard of reports of these agitators stirring up trouble. We don't need any room for criminals here, not in school, and not in society, am I clear? Why do I feel like that was directed towards me? I feel assaulted, thank you. <laughs> I hear this for incredible first year came. Yeah, while the girl in the ribbon is really thin, is she a first year? Aw oh, man, the delinquent and the honor student arriving at the same time? Uh oh. <laughs> Assault, blackmail, drugs, he's done it all. I hear he carries around a knife. That's a baseless rumor! And it's also slightly true. Hey there, Takamaki. Things have been pretty dangerous lately with all those accidents. Sorry, I have a photo shoot today. It's for the special summer issue, so I can't afford to miss it. Hey now, being a model's fine and dandy, but don't work your pretty little self to the bone. You mentioned you weren't feeling well, right? Something about appendicitis? Yes. I keep planning to go to the hospital, but I've been too busy. Sorry to worry you. You must be lonely, too. I feel bad for keeping your best friend at practice so often. Oh, and be careful around that transfer student. He's got a criminal record, after all. If something were to happen to you... Thank you. Please excuse me. Yo. <laughs> What's up? Waiting to ambush me? Ambush? Come on, don't say shit like that. <sighs> Anyways, I want to talk about that castle from yesterday. I tried telling myself it was all just a dream, but I couldn't do it. I can't act like nothing happened. It's all connected to that bastard Kamoshida, after all. I want to find out what's up with that place, no matter what. And you know, you're the only person I can rely on for this stuff, so... You in? <laughs> it was just a dream, but sure, what next? Nice! <laughs> okay, glad we're in this together. I think we should just try and retrace our steps from yesterday. In the meantime, you're walking to the station, right? Let's go together. Let me know if you notice any other weird buildings on the way. Yeah, I'll let you know if there's, a, like, another castle popping up out of nowhere. <laughs> Ryuji doesn't seem like a bad guy. I should probably just go along with this. Rumors are stupid. If a huge castle like that really exists, I'm sure we'll find it in no time. When did they build something like that, though? We walked that way from here, right? <laughs> Maybe. When you put it that way, I'm not so sure anymore. All right, this way. Let me know if you notice something. Huh? We're at school. There wasn't anything out of place along the way, right? I didn't see no castle either. Yeah, we must have made a wrong turn somewhere. Let's try again. <laughs> again? Don't worry, I won't mess up this time. That, uh, that doesn't make me feel confident. Let's go. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? Oh look, the school again. For real? Yeah, I'm starting to think it was a dream. Is it smaller than we think it is? What do you think? Hey, why don't you check your phone? I already did that, but I didn't see anything like it around here. Huh? Phone. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't you have a navigation app thingy on back then? Uh, navigation app? I don't know if it was or not, but I heard stuff that sounded like one coming from your phone. You know, didn't it say stuff like returned to the real world or something like that? <laughs> I vaguely remember that. Let's your phone for a bit. All right, just don't go into my photos. Okay. What's a 
ass eyeball looking thing. <laughs> Cute logo, huh? <laughs> I don't know what is it. I can't delete it. Wait, what? Yeah, I deleted it like three times and it just keeps coming back. What a weird app. It is a weird app. Oh, wait, this is it. I knew it. It is a navigation app. There's even your search history. Yo, don't look at my search history. Oh, man, I'm such a genius. Let's try using it. Wait, I don't know about this, dude. Maybe maybe you shouldn't. Why? All we're doing is starting an app. Yeah, but we don't even know what this app does. Kamoshida. Shujin Academy. Pervert. Castle. Beginning navigation. There we go. And then we went in a certain direction and... Uh... Hey, what are you... Huh? What the hell? So I was here the it's whole the time. From yesterday. Oh, whoa, wait for me. We made it back. That means what happened yesterday was for real, too. Yeah, I guess it ain't no dream. Yeah, those close. What about it? Oh, oh, hey. That happened last time, too, huh? What's with that outfit? Bro, I don't know. But you jelly? I, I ain't jealous. <laughs> That's the tone of jealousy right there. What's going on here? This makes no effing sense at all. Yeah, I agree. Hey. Stop making a commotion. <sighs> you? What's up, talking cat? The shadows started acting up, so I came here wondering what it could be. To think you guys would come back to the entrance when you barely managed to escape. What is this place? Is it the school? That's right. But it's a castle! This castle is the school. That makes no sense. But only to this castle's ruler. That also doesn't make sense. The castle's ruler? I think you called him Kamoshida? It's how his distorted heart views the school. Kamoshida? Distorted? Explain it in a way that makes sense! <laughs> Ryuji, he's saying that, like, Kamoshida rules this place, that it rules the school, and that he thinks it's a castle. It, it's as simple as that. I expected a moron to get it. What did you say? <laughs> What was that? It must be the slaves captive here. For real? Wait, there are slaves here? Oh shit, it's for real. We saw other guys held captive here yesterday. I'm pretty sure they're from our school. Most likely on Kamoshida's orders. It's nothing out of the ordinary. It's like that every day here. It's like that every day? What's more, you two escaped yesterday. He must have lost his temper quite a bit. That son of a bitch! Ryuji? This is bullshit! You hear me, Kamushita? Yo, do you want to get caught? Doing that isn't going to open it, you know. Still, it seems you have your reasons. Hey, Mona Mona! It's Morgana! Do you know where those voices are coming from? You want me to take you to them? Well, I guess I could guide you there. But only if he comes with us. <laughs> Wait, why me? Uh... I just want to get a better look at your powers. Even if you don't agree. I bet this guy will go on even if he has to do it alone. Are you going to leave him? Uh, I never said that I was going to leave him. I just want to know why. It's settled then. For real? Thanks, man. 
Yeah, no problem, dude. All right, let's do this. This is our infiltration point. Ain't that where we escaped out of last time? That's right. Not barging in through the entrance is one of the basics of phantom thievery. How are we supposed to know about that stuff? He has a point. I'll make sure to teach you as we go. Come on, follow me. So, uh, sorry for dragging you into all of this. But I just can't forgive that bastard Kamoshida doing whatever the hell he wants. Really, though, thanks for coming along. I owe you big time. All right, I'm gonna hold you to that. Man, this place is as creepy as always. Mm -hmm. Now make sure you do exactly as I say, all right? Follow me. All right, cat, I'm a, I'm a common. Hey, we went by here when we came in the front. What the? I was seeing double or something just now. Was that Shujin? I told you before, this place is your school. Regardless, we don't have time to stand around. Who knows when a shadow might show up. Come on, this way. Yeah, it would be a bad thing if a shadow shows up, whatever the hell that is. Head to the old cell, you got it! Shoot! I had a feeling there would be guards here. It looks like we're going to have to start fighting our way forward. Uh, for real? Oh boy. I'll just teach you the basics of battle for now. You'd better not forget all of this. I'm pretty sure I will forget about all this. Always try to ambush enemies instead of rushing everywhere headlong. Attack from behind whenever you can. You'll need to rip their masks off to momentarily break the control that the palace ruler has over them. If you succeed, your opponent will be caught off guard, allowing us to jump in for a preemptive attack. And that's your tutorials of how to go for battles. That's how you do first strikes. Just remember... So, we want to get the jump on him and make the first strike. Okay, got it. Uh, you know you're just going to be watching, right? You don't have a persona. Hey, he could fight. But anyway, let's go. Yep, so just walk up to them, spot this icon that immediately flashes and hope your reflexes are just as good. Now's our chance to strike. Persona. All right. Oh, I can't kill you in one hit anymore. What happened? It's like they got stronger in just one day. And I leveled up. So I'm telling you the next fight I'm gonna level up. Okay. All right, cool. Let's just uh, keep going then. Nothing exciting for us here. Let's just. Why ain't anyone here? Damn it! They were here before. Where'd they go? Maybe they were on break. Quiet down. Oh yeah, there were more of them further in too. They might have been transferred already. Oh crap, I can hear footsteps coming. Lots of them. It would be a problem if they discovered us now. Hey, let's head into that room. We should be able to hide in there until they leave. The shadows probably won't come in here. And what makes you so sure? How can you tell? There's a lack of distortion here, meaning the ruler's control over this area is weak. Oh. Is this a classroom? <laughs> That's what it looked like. Now do you understand? This place is another reality that the ruler's heart projects. This is Kamoshida's reality? Ugh, shit makes no sense at all. I agree. One could say it's a world in which one's distorted desires have materialized. I call such a place a palace. A palace? 
This is happening because he thinks the school is his own castle. So it became like this because he just thought of it like that? <laughs> Son of a bitch! You must really hate this Kamashita guy. Yeah, I agree. Do you have some sort of vendetta against him? Hate doesn't even cover how I feel. Ah. Everything is that asshole's fault. I don't know what happened between you two, but don't let your emotions get the better of you. His lackeys are everywhere inside. You're curious about your outfit, aren't you? Yeah, I'm curious as hell about it too. That's also because of this world. More stuff that makes no sense. Anything distorts according to how a ruler pleases within his palace. A school can turn into a castle like this, after all. In order to prevent such distortions, one must hold a powerful will of rebellion. Your appearance is a manifestation of that. It's the image of rebellion that you hold within. Ah, I'm so fed up with all this! I'm more curious about you than his clothes. What the hell are you anyways? Yeah, that's a good question. What are you? I'm a human. An honest to God human. You look like a cat. No, you're obviously more like a cat. This is, well, it's because I lost my true form. I think. It look, it's either you think or you know. There's not, there's no either or. You think? But I do know how to regain my true form. The reason why I snuck in here was for a preliminary investigation of those means. Well, I ended up getting caught, though. Besides, I've been tortured by Kamoshita, too. I'm gonna make him pay for sure. What is this, a comic book? This is seriously crazy. It does sound crazy. If we're gonna keep going, we should hurry along. I'll be counting on your skills this time too, rookie. Got it? Don't worry, I'm not gonna force it all on you. I thought it might help, so... I brought this just in case. It's a model gun, though, so it only makes sounds. I was about to say, you brought an actual gun? That's a toy! Well, yeah, Mona, that has, yeah, that's why it's called, like, you know, whatever, you're a cat, you don't understand. But it looks totally real, so it'll at least fake him out. Oh, I brought some medicine, too. You know what they say, providing is pre-something. Huh? Huh? So you were planning this from the start. At least he came prepared. Well, fine. If you're ready to go, we'll resume our infiltration. Hmm. There are probably still sentries making their rounds out there. Let's use this time to hash out our current situation. All right, well, I guess this gives us an explanation on safe rooms and what they do. TLDR, you can talk to your teammates and save your game. You should probably save your game. Trust me, you never know when something stupid will happen. So, like, whenever you're in the safe room, it, it's better to, like, it's better to be prepared. Also, is my, my gun equipped? It's not. It's okay. I guess we'll deal with that when the time comes. Uh, things have gotten somewhat troublesome. Damn it. Damn it, where'd those guys who were locked up go? They probably got moved to another location. But where and why? Don't ask me. Well. But there were soldiers around, right? Maybe we could try eavesdropping on them. <sighs> hmm. Weird. What do you got to say, Ryuji? Hopefully it's not the same. And you just say, damn, where those guys get locked up to? All right, cool. Um, you know what? Actually, we're going to call this an episode. <laughs> just because of, uh, yeah, yeah, I agree. This outfit is weird. So anyway, so if you like what you see here, slap that like button. Really like what you see here, slap the subscribe button. You won't? Great. If you do, blame yourself for listening to me. And I guess we're going to find those volleyball teams, people, players, whatever. They, they go to our school. You know what I mean. Do we? I don't know. Do I? What is even going on?